Hey there guys, it's the uh, Butter Baron here, and today we've got another episode of Legend of Zelda Spear Tracks. Um, now I did leave off the uh, last episode early, and that's because there's a little cutscene we have to go through in a second. Carbon is waiting in the train's passenger car. Let's hurry, hurry and take him to the ocean sanctuary. Alright. Okay, let's go. It's not really a cutscene, as you'll see. Here we go. Uh oh. Uh-oh. Oh no, pirates, we have to protect our passenger. Uh-oh. Oh no, pirates, dastardly kidnapping pirates. You must protect me from them, butts. You got it. Ha, get wrecked. Suck. Wrecked. Help, they're closing in on me. Trying my best. Take that. Wait, what was that? Oh, geez. Ooh, I don't want to be on the receiving end of that. Nope. No thanks, I'm good. How many hits does this guy take to die? No thanks. He just killed his own thing, guy. He killed his teammate. What the heck, man? Ooh. Getting all fancy with the backswing. No, I'm good. I don't want to take that hit. Uh-oh. Yeah, he killed another one. What the heck? Murderer? Backstabber? Or back bludgeoner? Doesn't really, he can't really stab anything with that thing. That big old club. Got him. Whew. Thank you, you really saved my hide there, but. Well, now that that l bit of unpleasantness is over, let's get to the sanctuary. Dolphins, Delfinos, oh yeah.
That's the way you do it. Ah, we finally made it. it. It was just a short distance away, but it felt so far. I suppose mortal peril has that effect on a person. You really must be more careful in the future, Butts. What's that? Here, this is for you. You look confused. I'll explain, Butts. Every living being possesses an energy, and this energy is similar to the energy that powers the spirit tracks. When a person's heart is especially happy or grateful, his energy levels become particularly strong. Energy lives in the hearts of everyone, even fe feeble old fellows like me. I don't express it well, but the bottom line is that I appreciate your help. Here, please take this. It belongs to you. You got a force gem. The force rail map has started glowing. Oh, great. I got a dead end. That's great. The force gem has energized the rail map. New tr tracks have appeared. You plan to continue your journey by train, do you not? Then you must always go forth with people's hearts in your mind. When you make people happy, their spirits emit energy. When this energy builds, new tracks appear. This should be very useful for your journey. Alright, I'll be he heading out to the sanctuary now. See you. What? It's only going to be like a couple seconds. What are you, what are you talking about? I still don't know why there's a mailbox here. Oh, this guy again. Dead-o. What if I do this? Oh, wow. Protects him from that, too. That's fun. Take that. Ooh, demon fossil. You got the demon fossil. It's like a normal fossil, but it's much more valuable. Check it out on the collection screen. I could probably erase all that, can't I? There we go. Alright. Thanks again for earlier, butts. Let me reintroduce myself. I am Carbon, Guardian of the Ocean Realm. You're here to restore the spirit tracks, aren't you? Yes, I am. But of course, you've come all this way, so I'll do everything I can to help. Very well done. In order to restore the tracks, I'll need your help. Do you know about the lo- You know- Do know about the Locomo songs, don't you? Yes. This song requires two different instruments to play different parts. I'll teach you your part, so listen well. Just copy what I do. Once you've had enough practice, you can put down your flute. Okay, I think I got it. Th that's it. Would you like to practice more or try the real thing? Real thing. All right, remember this is a duet, so don't let my part distract you. Um, you're all just all over the place. What's going on? At least try to follow my lead, won't you? Would you like to try again or practice more? Try again. I got it this time.
There we go. Awesome. Second try. Pretty beautiful songs. You completed the duet with Carbon, the locomo of the Ocean Realm. The Ocean Rail map has started glowing. Whoa! That's a lot of tracks. New tracks have appeared. A portion of the tracks leading to the t Ocean Temple has been restored. The Ocean Temple itself, however, resides deep on the ocean floor? Only a tiny part of it is visible above sea level. To go to the Ocean Temple, you must first head to the ocean floor. What, you're wondering if the train can travel on the ocean floor? How dare you question the spirit's strength? The ocean floor is covered with rails, so of course the train can move freely there. The way to get down there is... Blast, I can't remember where the entrance is. Oh yes, now I remember. I knew I might need this information later. That's why I wrote it down for myself, just in case. Here, take this with you. You got Carbon's letter. It has instructions on how to get to the ocean floor. Go to the collection screen to read it. I wish you success. Okay. I guess we'll do that. We'll probably just get to the temple and then end off the episode. there we've restored the tracks why don't we head out to the ocean temple okay okay then let's go um, I don't know where we're going so uh, we're going to check out the collection screen, as it keeps telling us to do. Dear self, I know you'll forget, so I'm leaving you instructions to get to the ocean floor. Carbon. Um, not sure I follow, but... Uh, two... One... Three... No, that's not three. This is three. Okay. So I guess we're supposed to go like this, I suppose. All right, let's go. Oops, sorry, sorry, dolphin. <gasps> Bunny. Get the bunny! Get it! Got him! You got an ocean rabbit. Go show the guy at Rabbit Land Rescue. There's one of those things. I don't remember what it does do. Hey, look, it's Ferris! Let's see him. Uh... So, we meet again. I hear, heard the ocean spear tracks have returned, so I came to see it for myself. It's just a rumor, but I hear there are even tracks that run under the water. Oh, and guess what else? Just guess. They say there are sculptures that react to big noises out there, too. Okay. Not sure I follow, but okay. And by big noises, does he mean like my train whistle like this? Does that count as a big noise? I guess so. Hey, there's one of those squiddy things. Another bunny? Heck yeah.
Ah, I missed it. Oh, I got away. Bye, dolphins. They brought me a heart, I think. Okay, so what's up with the what's up with this stuff over here? We're about to find out. I'm recording. doing exactly uh, oh there we go uh, I guess that's what Ferris meant so are there like three of those like one at each point probably get some rupees two of them now. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Just had to get them re- Oh, there's another bunny! Oh, dang. I hit it before I even thought about hitting it. Got one. You got an ocean rabbit. Go show the guy at Rabbit Land Rescue. Okay. Hey, there's a statue. Mm, got it. Pirates! No, you won't capture me. You'll never take me alive. Dead. No! That was close. Okay, so. Oh, there's another one of those things. There we go. Huh? Whoa, that's pretty cool. Wait, are we going in a fish's mouth? Is this like the great Jabu Jabu's belly? If you never heard of that dungeon, it's like in the Ocarina of Time. Wow, it's breathtaking down here, butts. Who knew the spirit tracks ran underwater? I sure didn't. I guess that's the temple. Oh, we got missiles. That's pretty cool. Oh, there's a big giant kraken thingy. Oh, we haven't been marking our thingy. Oops. Kill it. Die. Don't bother me. Stop. Get it off! Oh, that was annoying. Hang on, let me shoot those. Oh, get rupees. That's pretty cool. I still want to, uh, How is there smoke underwater again? Exactly, and... Oh, I guess I'm in... I guess I'm in a bubble, apparently. There's another one of those things here. We're probably not coming back, but, you know... Better be prepared. 
We killed that one much easier than the other one. Yeah. Rupees. Yeah. Oh, I got it. Okay. Uh-oh, what's... Oh, oh jeez. There's an evil train thingy. And that this one's pointy-nosed thing. I guess we're gonna go around that way. So he's, he's, uh, he's chasing us. And he, he, he switched directions. Is that, is that a bad? I think that's a bad. That's probably a bad. I think it's gaining on us. No, it's not gaining on us. Oh, there's another one. Oh, geez. Oh, this one, that one's not the thing, I guess. So what am I supposed to do? Oh, what if I hang a, a thing there and then go back that way? That could work, right? Probably. Oh, geez, lag, lag. Who knew a Zelda game could be laggy? Oh, jeez. Another thingy. Let's make that on the map. Got him. Oh, jeez, is it gaining? Oh, I see it now. I think it might be gaining, guys. This might be the end for us. Yeah, we're getting rupees though, so that's good. there. Wow, there's sure are a lot of these things. There's like more of these than there were barrels in the overworld. Lag. Think we're gonna get there yeah i think we win yeah we're here unless like an evil train pops out right now okay never mind that would have been pretty cruel on uh nintendo's part So here we are at the Ocean Temple. So you're ready to go on in, right, butts? Oh yeah. Okay then, onward. But that's gonna be in the next episode. So uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this one's a bit longer than most, so I'll just cut it here. Like, subscribe, comment. There you go, Butter Baron.